Today we're gonna see how to send long videos and any heavy document on WhatsApp. So today I'm gonna show you two different ways to send heavy uh, documents on WhatsApp. So the first method is very simple as well as the second one, but I'm gonna start with this one first because I think it's more direct. So the first one is using WeTransfer. So I'm pretty sure everybody is familiar with WeTransfer. It's a service that allows you to upload a file online and send it to a friend or whoever it is. The only difference that we're gonna do today is that we're not gonna send a file to an email address, but if you go to this window right here on WeTransfer, let me reload this for you guys. So if we go to WeTransfer, this is what we're gonna have and if we click on these three dots in the bottom left corner we can send a file with a link so instead of send email transfer we get and we put get transfer link so if we upload let's say uh let's say this file that is like 98 megabytes on we transfer mm -hmm. and we click on get link we are gonna uh, upload this on WinTransfer and at the end we're gonna have a link to just copy and paste on WhatsApp. So as you can see now it has done uploading it and we get this link. So we can do copy link and paste it on WhatsApp. And let me show you guys what the other person is gonna see if we paste this link and open it. This is what is going to appear. This window and we can or whoever receives this link will be able to download this file. Now this works on the computer as well as on the app. Exact same thing. But instead of opening in Chrome, it's going to open in probably in Safari or whatever you guys are using on your iPhone or Android. So the second method that I always use to send large files, because if we want to keep everything free, WeTransfer has a two gigabyte limit. So if I remove uh, this one, you'll see that it's going to say two gigabyte here. So let's say that you need to send something heavier than two gigabytes. Then the second method is perfect. The one that I'm talking about is using Google Drive. So let's take an example again. This video right here is 97 uh, megabytes, but this works with anything that is 10, 8, 15 gigabytes, whatever you guys need. And then uh, once we're here, we can go ahead and open it. And I'm going to pause it for the moment. And then click here on the three dots in the top right, uh, right hand corner. Click share. Here on general access, instead of restricted, we need to change it with anyone with the link. And then again, copy link. So once the uh, link is copied, we can go ahead and paste it on WhatsApp and send it. So this is even better than WeTransfer because it requires you to upload it up front on Google Drive. That's true. But whoever receives the link will be able, especially if it's a video, to preview it without downloading it. So let me show you, if I open an incognito window right now and paste this link, they will be able to see the video in preview as fast as that. So this is a great method to send again any type of heavy uh, file that you might want to send. So guys, these are the two my my two favorite methods that I use all the time to send large videos and large files on WhatsApp. Let me do, let me know what you guys think, and if this video helped you, please uh, consider subscribing and liking this video for more content. Yeah.